it's Kate here and I am back with another Monsters Inc. update video and this time we are talking all things lovely Monster Star Path. So we just got the key art released by Disney Dream and Valley on their Twitter earlier yesterday. Before I get into it, I just want to say I am super excited for this update. How about you guys? If you are, then make sure you please like this video to let me know that you are excited as much as I am. You cannot wait for Mike and Sully to arrive very soon. And if you are very hyped for this this incredible sweet and monstrous star pad that we will have fun unlocking and getting to nitpick a little bit what we can expect for items decorations new pet companion skins and even more for our avatars with customization coming in store so let's dive into breaking down what this key art has in store for us and let's get monstrous all right my kids here it is up on screen the lovely monster star pads so are front and center we have the iconic duel themselves mike and sully sporting and rocking a matching varsity jacket set which i believe might be the first time we are seeing something like this in the valley other than minnie and mickey that have like a match set of outfits or clothing so this is absolutely very cute i love that they're kind of going with more of like the monsters university kind of vibe as well shout out reference to that if you've seen that movie as well but i love how these two have a different look about it with the same jacket now now, for me, I would prefer Mike's horns to be shown and like a halfway cutoff point behind his head. But I understand the design is to conform to his one eye because that's what it is. He has one eye. And in like Mike's spirit, he's always getting covered up, right? And I love how his smile is just barely peeking through like the opening way of the jacket. And then we have Sully over here looking chill and cool and collected as always with his smile that we all know and love to be iconic. And he's just looking like he's just ready to go out and about walking in our valley just sporting off the goods sporting off that scare spirit that he has with mike and i think this is such a cute way to introduce these two and to have items for them already when they're being introduced to our game now we also have our characters front and center of different variations and avatar designs and outfits that we can look forward to as well. Now, in the last video that I did covering Monster Inc. and the update, we were also given the same door pattern outfit, but in a pants and top form. Now, that could be just a pants alone, maybe a customized top, or it could be a set itself. But I love that we're seeing a pattern themed here with like the doors because that's the theme of like Monsters Inc. is the doors. And I love this little costume that we have for our other character variation as well from the lovely part of the star path with the red bow tie the pink shirt and the red suspenders now i would love to see how this will look on the female character but this is absolutely so cute and honestly this character gives me middle school homecoming dance vibes i don't know why but it's such a cute like low outfit it's adorable i love it no roasting here i just i love the colors it reminds me of valentine's day and i wouldn't go at a guy if they wore this outfit on the day i think it's charming and it's it's very sweet. So on the left hand side, we have plushies. Now, this could be a cluster or like a three on one kind of deal. So we might have this as like an actual like set of it being all in one. Now, if you could have each one of these plushies as its own, I will love that. But knowing Disney Dream Valley to kind of have something that takes up more space, it'll probably be that they come together as like a whole item set instead of just individually being able to place around the valley. But I love how they have different sizing of the monsters and also design. We have the purple one, which is a large plushie with all these little stitching patchworks and the three eyes. And then we have the green one with the two eyes and his little spikes and the little toe spikes that he has. And then the little itty bitty baby one that's blue with the one eye. So that is absolutely adorable. And I'm glad that we're getting more plushies and dolls in the game too, because we do have a few. We have the snowman one and we also have Boo's one that she has that is also in the movie. But I hope we get more decorations like this in the future because I think that be a fun addition to Philip space in dream snaps or any type of room more like a clutter cozy feeling which I know all of my cozy designers that love clutter are out there would absolutely agree with me because I am the same way just a whole wall of plushies that would be absolutely to die for now moving on to the right hand side oh my gosh guys I think these items are going to be absolutely to die for to start unlocking as soon as possible this beautiful romantic archway with the pillars really does give off like a romantic romantic greek mythology hidden secret garden to like go take a picnic or stroll down with and i know a lot of us are probably going to start redesigning our valleys real quick real soon for these arch 
ways. There are so many ways you can decorate with them and so many build designs that I'm already thinking of myself for me to like get started on in my valley. And I can't wait to see how you guys use these items in your future builds as well or even dream snaps, which I think they will be so lovely to have around somewhere in our valleys. And I cannot wait to unlock it and see in its full glory. But it is so cute. I love the trail of flowers that are cascading above the arch and then wrapping around the pillars is absolutely so sweet and then we have this adorable cute little romantic date setup from the lady and tramp inspired scene where they're both eating spaghetti under the moonlit sky with their breadsticks and this baby turtle my kids oh my gosh this is by far going to be one of my probably most used turtle variations in the game because it's pink it looks fluffy it's so cute and i love how its belly literally glows pink and it's heart shaped and its flippers are also of that same design pattern and glowing too and its shell looks like a romantic sweet fluffy cotton candy cloud that you see far off in the distance in a sweet romantic sunset lit dinner I absolutely am so excited to get this turtle in my valley and by my side and just looking so cute and adorable and it's gonna be called Cupid because why not it might be the most obvious name choice but I don't care I think it suits it and I I'm not mad about it so. <laughs> so i'm super excited to get those two items as well in the game from the star path along with this rug now this rug looks new it looks like something that we can also look forward to seeing in the star path possibly if it's anything like the snowflake rug that we got from the last star path that would be very cool to also get this one as well just to have like a little spot for just a night out in the valley just somewhere where you have like this little setup put somewhere with the archways which i think would be so romantic and then also we have this swan boat guys i can already see the dream snaps i can already see this being used in the background to just give life to the pond area so that's not so bare and oh my gosh imagine putting the lily pads around it too <gasps> to make it glow pink guys i'm super excited i cannot wait to see what you guys come up with with these new decorations and items and how your valleys are going to be kind of like in a sense romanticized and romanticified i'm not sure that's over but i cannot wait to see what amazing builds and the very pink builds you guys are going to come up with and i cannot wait to also share with you guys what i put together when i do get a chance to get my hands on these items as well but that is it for what we can expect a little bit of the star path items and i hope this gets you guys hyped for tomorrow's update because i am super hyped i cannot wait i'm probably gonna be start grinding it as soon as it launches and trying to build up on my dream light or whatever it is i need to be able to unlock these a lot sooner but i cannot wait i'm super excited super happy to have fun with you guys on this update thank you guys so much for tuning in today's video for sticking through for going over everything in this video with me and i cannot wait to hear your thoughts and opinions in the comments below what are you most excited for what side of this art path are you looking forward to unlocking the most of are you team monsters are you team lovely let me know i would love to hear what you guys have to say but if you want to make sure you're up to date on anything and everything that i covered at disney dreamlight valley then please make sure you become a kid to the best club on the internet click that like button for me to let me know you are enjoying the content so far and don't forget to subscribe because i hope to make more video content of different topics of variations and niches within dreamlight valley so stay tuned for future videos videos on whatever i can share with you guys on my magical journey on dreamlight valley and remember my kids you have the magic of friendship with you so no matter wherever and whomever you encounter you have the magic to spread and share it on my behalf and on behalf of the kit army without further ado i'll games on next time bye